mangroves are under threat. They've been under threat for more than 50 years, perhaps challenged most significantly in their millions and millions of years of presence on the earth, but now facing serious challenge through urbanization, water management, and most recently, sea level rise. beautiful and dense. My name is uh, Dr. Randall Parkinson. I am a coastal geologist. Wetlands in general and certainly mangroves in particular uh, provide a lot of very important functions to not only the ecosystem but also to uh, the economics of our coastal regions throughout the world. They are very important habitat for a lot of commercial and recreational species, threatened and endangered species. Mangrove forests and wetlands provide a buffer to storm surge and the energy associated with storms. They take that in so that areas behind them, perhaps urban, aren't bearing the brunt of that energy. They are taking CO2 out of the atmosphere and storing it below ground. They have a huge capacity to help us combat climate change. As sea level rises, under normal and natural conditions, wetlands would have moved mangroves into areas that used to be land, dry land. And as sea level rises, the dry land gets wetter, mangroves migrate into it, everything just migrates landward in a, like a tank tread type fashion. Well, that can't occur in most areas anymore because we often have shore parallel roads which block the mangroves from migrating on shore. So with sea level rise, on top of the problems with urbanization, the ocean shoreline is moving inland. The mangroves would like to be moving more landward, but they can't, so we just Get, they get pinched out, and then we lose them at that location forever. If these go, all the things that we talk about go, and then what are we left with? Not only do we lose this beautiful uh, landscape, uh, but we lose all the things that it does for us. It is an enormous challenge to try to protect this, and there are efforts to, to try to do that. I just hope uh, that we're not too late. <laughs>